guys, Madman Mondello coming at you live from the Garden Hill Garage here in beautiful Alabama. All right. Fernando. The stars are bright. Fernando. No, this console's freaking bright, bitch. Listen. <laughs> I'm kidding with you, man. Listen. Uh, okay. Fernando. Now, this, guy, this cat's really cool. He sent, me, uh, he sent me this Xbox. Of course, it was covered in stickers, which, of course, he did not mention. And not only were they on the top, they were also on the bottom. Okay, this thing went through many stages of cleaning and um, getting the crap off of the top of the console and the bottom of the console and inside the console, everywhere. <laughs> but Fernando's cool. He's he, he's a cool cat, you know. I mean, uh, this guy he's a he, he's a guy after my own heart, actually. Um, anyone that would that would have a 671 blower, okay, sitting on their kitchen island, okay, is okay in my book. All right, and the simple fact is, is that this guy ha is is part of a chapter, okay, and um, you know they they build performance parts and everything, and he's got a 350 SS truck, all right, and uh, a little blower's going on there, and uh, Fernando, um, <laughs> he knows as well as I do because I'm a gearhead too, all right, that all the coveted parts go in the house, they don't go out in the garage, okay, and the really coveted parts wind up in the bedroom. Okay, so <laughs> I can identify with you, okay? So anyway, uh, he wanted me to do a uh, custom console. He sent this in to me, all right? And um, as I said, I, I, I removed all the schmegma off the top of it and the bottom and the sides and the ROL and everything else, okay? So we did a uh, couple of custom um, logos for him that uh, I designed. He sent me a couple of pictures. They were completely unusable, all right, because they had so many colors. So I just had to do this like crazy my way okay so anyway here's what we got here okay we have this where it says here on Diodos performance that's say is Denver Colorado chapter that's where he's out of we did some pinstriping uh, to match what he likes all right and that is an actual rendering of his truck okay so uh, we went ahead and we uh, inlaid it as you can see you know, they just pop out the top of the console, okay? That's the way I like them, so it gives it a nice little effect. So anyway, uh, we're going to light the fire and kick the tires, okay? We're going to boot it up, all right? And as you can see, yes, it is completely nutso, all right? And in fact, um, yeah, it goes all crazy. Yeah, I did your ROL with uh, blue with purple tracers, okay? And it does all different kinds of modes. we got red, green, blue, white. And these are programmable, individual, addressable ROMs. I, I'm ROMs. Yeah, okay. All right. Excuse me. LEDs. All right. See, welcome to Alliance. We're going to get one more. And there we are. You're out on the purge. All right. And uh, it's got all different types of modes. Okay, as you can see. It does all kinds of crazy colors and does all nutty stuff. And you can just, like, like go, like, it, yeah, okay. I'm starting to get seasick now, all right, so anyway, yeah, as you can see, yeah, she lit up real nice, man, really, really nice, so I hope that you like it, man, and yes, I did that, <laughs> yes, I did, I did that, by hand, because your picture was completely unusable, I could not vectorize that thing to save my life, there's too many colors, so, anyway, uh, there you go, all right, and that's all done, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set you up over here, okay, and of course, in the spirit of GTA 5. I went ahead and what I did was I put the uh, GTA 5 theme on there for you for FSD Dash. Alright, as you can see in the background, there's a nice little uh, goat. A GTO Judge sitting there. Yes, they were wonderful cars. I love them. 455 with a 373 rear. Man, right from the factory. Oh, so nice. So sweet. Alright, so anyway, um, let's roll through this, shall we? Okay. Under emulators, you got Genesis Plus 360, SNES 360, and MAME. A complement of ROMs on there that will keep you busy for a long time and then some. If you're into retro games, you're into the old console games, the old arcade games, that's where to go. Okay, Xbox Classic games. We got uh, we got quite a few on there, okay? We have uh, Ghost Recon. We have Tony Hawk's Underground 2. Halo 2. Halo, the original. Vice City. And Grand Theft Auto 3. All right, homebrew section. Okay, here we go. We have Dash Launch, XM360, XCX Menu, Xbox 360 Dashboard, Voice Changer 360, uh, Simple Nail Flasher, Internet Explorer, FX Menu, Flash 360, and Back to Dash Launch. And then we have Xbox Live Arcade. 
Okay, and there is mind-boggling amount of arcade games, including one of my favorites, Trailer Park King. There you go. <laughs> and then, of course, we have our Xbox 360 games, okay? Now, here we go. We have Advanced Warfare, Saw 2, Saw 3, Red Dead Redemption, Marvel Warfare 3, Marvel Warfare 2, Minecraft, Halo Reach, Halo 3, Grand Theft Auto uh, San Andreas, Grand Theft Auto 5, Gears of War Judgment, Gears of War 3, Gears of War 2, Gears of War, Call of Duty World at War, Black Ops 3, Ghost, Black Ops 2, Black Ops, Call of Duty 4, Call of Duty 3, Call of Duty 2, Battlefield Bad Company 2, Battlefield 4, and back to Advanced Warfare. Okay? Quite a lot of titles on there. Alright? To get to the original dashboard, go to your homebrew section right here. And all you gotta do is just hit A at Xbox 360 Dashboard. Hit A again. That will take you to the original dashboard. And there you are. Hello again, Fernando Torres. The stars are bright, Fernando. Okay. So, anyway, there you are. You currently have three reserve days left. Got it good? Okay? Bypass the sign-in. And as you can see, you're up, you're online, you are live. Here's our beautiful eyeball-pleasing HUD. Over on Fifth Ab, our Ghost Cheats and Modern Warfare 3 Cheats. To bring it back to, uh, bring it back to the Dash, smash the A button on the Xbox. Oh, there you go. All right. Now, my friend. <laughs> okay. Now, there is a certain way that you have to start this console up for the first time. Okay. And I'm going to tell you how to do that. Okay. So. Oh, and by the way, here's your remote, okay, with all the functions. you got you got 300 modes on this thing, so there you go, all right? Now, look, when you get this thing, okay, what I want you to do, okay, before you power it on, is I want you to take the hard drive, disk drive cover off, and I want you to grab hold of your hard drive, which happens to be a 250, and set it up on top there, okay? Then, what I want you to do is I want you to power this puppy on. Okay, when you do, you're going to come to the Xbox Blackboard screen. When you come to the Blackboard screen, slide to the right. Go to System, go to Settings, go to Network Settings, all right? On your Network Settings, okay, you're going to see your Wi-Fi access point pop up. I want you to click on it. When you do, you're going to put your password in, and then it's going to initialize a test. It's going to check mark off LAN. It's going to fail on Internet. It's going to fail on Xbox Live. Once it completely fails, okay, what I want you to do, I want you to shut it down. Then I want you to take the hard drive. I want you to slip it back in. Okay, and then what I want you to do, take the drive door, put it back on. Then I want you to pull the power cord and let this sit for about three to five minutes, okay? We want to clear the SMC. We don't want any DNS junk in there. We want to reset all, all resolves and everything. I want it dead, completely dead, all right? Then, after about three to five minutes, plug it back in, power it back on, and you'll be good to go, all right? So listen, brother. Thank you for your business. I greatly appreciate it. We're going to be shipping it off tomorrow. Lorraine will have a tracking number for you by tomorrow evening. Thank you so much once again, brother. And as I said, keep rocking the uh, keep rocking that blower there, man. That thing's going to be nasty. I want I expect a video of that truck when you're done, man. I want to see that thing. Uh, that thing's going to be like, oh, <laughs> just that blower alone, man, with the twin carbs. I was like, yeah, that thing's going to move. So, anyway, listen, you have a good one, brother. And like I said, we'll get her shipped out to you tomorrow. Thanks again. You have a good one, guys. Holler at you later. I'm on to my next conquest. Here we go. <laughs> See you later.